Hello everyone, this is the crazy man from Ireland and we are playing Farming Simulator 2022. In this video I'm going to show you a full list of all the combine harvesters that are in game and on DLC. So let's hop into the game and let's see what combine harvesters and headers there are in the base game. So here we are, let's go to harvesters. This is going to be a, a bit of a long video because there's a lot uh, to take in here. So I'm just going to show you the first combine here, the Rastelish Marsh. Uh, this is, if you look at the bottom of your screen, it's 175 horsepower, uh, it holds 510 litres of fuel, 20 kilometres an hour, and it holds 4,900 litres of product. Underneath that, it'll show you what the combine actually uh, can store in its bin. Uh, so let's go into it and let's have a look. This is it, pretty standard combine. Uh, you can change the wheels like that, uh, the wheel setup, and you can change the number plate. Um, if you want to change the number plate from the front to the back, uh, back only, or no plate at all. You can also change the color of the number plate, if you wish. This is Rust Dalmish. Moving on, we've the Deutz Fair. I'm not going to uh, go into every single detail uh, from now on. I only just did that for the first one. You can see what it holds on the very bottom of your screen. And I'm just going to give you a quick look at the combine. Same story with the wheels and same story with the number plate. There we go. Kind of an old style boxy looking combine. Uh, moving on, here we have the New Holland. So this holds... Uh, Wheat, barley, oats, canola, uh, sorghum, uh, it'll hold sunflowers, soybeans, and corn. There we go. Nice little New Holland. And uh, moving on with the John Deere. There we go. This is the T560. I know that's not going to make much of a difference to your day. <clears throat> if you want to have a look at the bottom of your screen for longer, then pause the video and you will uh, see what's going on. So here we have twin wheels, uh, single wheels. You can obviously change uh, the tires, you know, all that kind of good stuff. Nice little case combine. There we go. So that is uh, the ac case axle flow, 7150. Moving along, we have a case, class, sorry, class. So this holds between 10,500 and 12,000 liters of product. As we go along here, the combines get that little bit bigger and they get uh, more expensive. There we go with the class. And we have the Massey. There we go. And moving along, we've got the Fent uh, Ideal here. So you can increase the uh, the horsepower if you want. Uh, we've got a uh, case uh, 90, 9,250, 92.50 if you want. So you got the twin wheels, you got this, the track on this. Wide tires, I always go with the wide tires or standard, whatever you want. There we go. And we're with the John Deere. So the John Deere is the, you can get an EU version, US. I do like the wider track, being honest. And you got the, the pipe length as well. Look, you can go long, short. Same story with the, the number plate. There we go. And we have the ideal Massey here again. There you go. And 
we've got a Fent Ideal. These are, I, I, I don't know what's going on with the brands. Are they the same brand or what? Are they after merging? I'm not too sure. Uh, Fent is, is supposed to be green, not black. I'm not really a fan of the black, being honest myself. There you go. <clears throat> so we got the class. We got the class Lexion uh, 8900. So you can uh, have small or big. There we go. There's a class. Right, that's is. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the, the headers that go on them combines, right? So here we go with the headers. So there's the Rastalish Mesh there. You've got this one. You've got the Deutz one for the Deutz combine. You got the case, which is twenty-five foot. As uh, some, it depends on what you want. It's, there's other cases along here as well, which are wider. Look, this one is um, eight point five meters. Uh, the one here is uh, seven point five. So it all depends on what you want to do. Uh, anyway, so here we go. There is the new Holland. You've got a um, seven point six meter John Deere. You've got the, uh, the 8.5 meter Holland. You've got the case, 8.5. You've got the Fent, 9.2. Uh, the, all the, the crops on the bottom is what these headers will harvest. So you've got the Massey Ferguson there. You've got a class, 10.8. Uh, Fent, 12 meter. You've got a 12 meter uh, Massey one. And you've got the Fent 12. You've got the Massey 12. Uh, you've got the Case 12. You've got that one. That does the sunflowers. Uh, you've got the Case with the trailer. It's got its own trailer, which is really handy if you're. Uh, you know, instead of getting the header trader, you just you can fold that away. That's really cool. Uh, you got the John Deere, uh, thirteen point seven meter. You got the class, thirteen point eight. The John Deere, fifteen point two. And that is it. That is it. I actually thought th th there was a New Holland uh, trailer one there. Some of the stuff they've removed from this game. I, I don't know what's going on with the game, but there was definitely a New Holland one of the uh, the case brand uh, with, with the with the trailer. I, I don't know what's uh, what's happening. Right, so we're going from the headers. We're going to the corner headers. Now, the ordinary headers and the corner headers do fit the combines that I just mentioned. So we're going here. So we've got... Uh, now, this one does... Uh, the corn and the sunflowers. All of these do corn and sunflowers, okay? So you got that one, the 3.4 meter. You got the case, 6 meter. Uh, 6 meter Holland. Uh, 6 meter deer. You got a class, 6 meter as well. You got a 6 meter. This one, now some of these you can actually change the colors. Uh, this one you can't, but some of them Capella ones you can change. Uh, the color. So you got the class one here. That's a nine meter, uh, a nine uh, Capella one. Can you fold this? You can fold this one. Look, you can see that it folds because it's got the, the the folding option on it. Uh, that's a nine meter. Uh, you got the case one here. I don't think you can fold. You can't fold this. You can, as you can see, you can fold it. We we'll move along nice and handy. Uh, so you got the John Deere one as well. You can can you fold this? You can fold this. Look, you got the rams on it, or cylinders, whatever you want to call it, wherever country you come from. That is it. So that's a full list of corn headers. You have a full list of ordinary headers, corn headers, and you have a full list of the the combines. So we're going to get out of this and we're going to go to the DLC and uh, see what's available there. That's my chair squeaking. By the way, I've got to oil it. God damn thing. <clears throat> right. So this should load up. Right. 
So we'll go into uh, do downloadable content. All the most of the downloadable content is uh, free, okay? So you just gotta click on it and Bob's your uncle. Right, so we got this one. Right here. Uh, we've got a John Deere one, which is here. Uh, we've got another John Deere one that's here. Nice old style one. If you want to, if I'm going too fast for you, pause the video and you will be able to see uh, what's on the screen. I'm not going to go through every single thing because I'm just going to be forever doing it. Here is a New Holland. Uh, there's a lot of packs here. So, you know, if, if anybody wants a pack of something. Um, Capello pack right here. Different sizes, different widths. There you go. Class. A big class pack there. We got this one. There you go. <clears throat> this is for... I have absolutely no idea what this is for. Um, pack, header... I don't know what it's for. I've never used it. That's there. Uh, moving on. Uh, class, headers, different widths, prices. All that good stuff. There you go. Uh, New Holland. Nice New Holland. And we're moving along. Another New Holland pack here. Uh, this is kind of an American style one. It's uh, you got a tinted windows and all that. All the DLCs are different to the in-game um, combines. Okay, they're not the same. They've, you can do different things with them. Okay, so just don't think they're the same. They're not. They're just they're different. Uh, more class headers. There you go. Um, this is a, a a fifth wheel for uh, truck trailers. I absolutely just don't know why that's in there. Uh, let's move on to the Holland. Uh, so there we go. More new Holland combines. The CX5.80. If that makes any difference to your day. We've got some header trailers. There. There you go. Header trailers. Here we've got um, an old style combine. If you're into the old style farming, there's lots of old style stuff here. Header trailers and stuff here. This is another pack. There we go. I'm not messing around. I'm going to keep moving with this. Uh, so you got more header trailers. Uh, header headers here for your combines and stuff. There you go. Uh, a New Holland uh, TC59. This is, I, I, I'm using this at the moment uh, in the game. This is a nice combine, I swear. That is a really nice combine. I like the big wide tires on the front of it. Pretty cool. Right, we're moving on. Honeybee, here we go. Um, <clears throat> this combine takes uh, 15,855 litres. Pretty nice deer. Uh, moving on. This is the Honeybee uh, Air Flex Series. I have no idea. It just. That's deer. Uh, moving on, um, we have the Rastelish Marsh here. There we go. Uh, a New Holland header. This is 9.15 meters. Some of these look, be honest with you, look all the same to me. Here's another bunch of headers. New Holland in case. There we go. Uh, New Holland combines, tinted windows, tracks, double wheels. All there for you. There we go. So we've got another um, header here. That is a foldable header, as far as I know. Um, Case International. Case. There you go. Uh, we got the Versatile. This one. That is not a bad looking harvester. L look at the tracks on that. I think the tracks on this looks better than the, any of the other combines. And the Versatile is not really one of the brands that are kind of really popular. You know, but it, the tracks really suit it. Uh, class Lexion. Pack. There you go. Another pack. Uh, moving along, we've got the Class um, Header Pack. There you go. Lots of Class stuff. Lots of um, New Holland stuff. There you go, more headers, 
plenty headers for you. Loads of them. Loads of the things. Here's another John Deere. There you go. Class Dominator pack. I've used this in the past. Nice little pack. Really nice. It's the old style class combines. There you go. Uh, so we've got the Ideal. There you go. Another New Holland CX8 series. Moving along, we've got a case header. There you go. Uh, Klax class uh, Tryon. Is that? Am I saying that right? I'm not too sure. Another pack. There you go. Now I'm gonna miss. I'm gonna skip this because this is not a, a combine. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna miss that. That's, uh, for grapes are um, what does this say it's for um, I have no idea uh, for coffee uh, so this is a coffee harvester it's just in there uh, so we've got a New Holland uh, pack here another old style New Holland uh, we've this one you can change the colors in this. There you go. And we've got a Deutz Fair, or is it just a fair with no Deutz in it? There you go. Moving along, I'm gonna make this as quick and po painless as possible. <laughs> we've got a Deutz combine pack. There you go. Um, a front shield. There you go. I'm uh, moving along. Uh, we've got um, a case axle flow. There you go. Another case pack. Another John Deere pack. Uh, another axle flow. So this is the US series. We've got a lizard, uh, lizard corn, and a sunflower header. Moving along, we've got the John Deere. Uh, 9600 and 9610. There we go. Now, this is uh, a, a really special combine because this combine takes a load of uh, a load of product. I'm trying to get it down. Um, so this takes 14,000 liters, does it? I actually thought it took more. I know it does one of these takes a ridiculous amount of product. Um, 14,100 I think it takes more being honest um, it's saying that but I'm sure that takes more uh, we got the lizard here uh, we got some John Deere headers yeah and uh, we've got uh, more harvesters so you can have the Fent or um, the Massey, which is pretty cool. They're the exact same combine as what they got. They're the exact same, just pick a brand. Uh, case, combine. An old boxy style case combine. Pretty nice. I actually use these in my games. Uh, moving along, we've got the class. There you go. Got a John Deere. There you go. Uh, we've got the Massey. We've got a New Holland. We've got a John Deere, a uh, corn and a uh, sunflower header pack. There you go. Uh, we've got this one. And moving along, we've got the Class Dominator Maxi Pack right here. Uh, this is Combine and Header. Yep. Moving along, more Class. Tucano Pack. Moving along, we've got another Header. Uh, Deutz Fair. Uh, 
And we've got a John Deere header. 6.7 meters. We've got a John Deere here. Uh, this takes uh, 22,905 litres. And we're coming to the end nearly. So we've got a Capello Quasar uh, foldable header here. Some of these headers you can actually change the colour, which is pretty sweet. Moving along, Lizard header here. John, uh, we've got a class combine here. More John Deere headers. Small header here. Got a John Deere. This takes between 14,100 liters to 17,629 liters of product. We're near the end, boys and girls. Uh, so we've got a John Deere here. This, this takes 27,400 liters. This is huge. I use this in my some of my gameplay. This is nuts. Uh, John Deere header again. John Deere header. We've got another John Deere header here. Here we go. Uh, we've got a, a New Holland uh, combine, and we have the last combine in this uh, video, which is the New Holland TX32. I'm just going to show you the screenshots of this because it's the last one. There we go. That is it. So that is it. So that's a full list of all the combines and headers uh, in game and DLC for Farming Simulator 2022. So there is tons and tons of options there uh, for everybody. So that is it for me for today. Uh, we'll talk to you all in the next one.